Hi everyone, I'm Frank Somerville. Game five of the NBA Finals between the Warriors and the Cavaliers is going to be played here on Sunday night. And to me, that means one more chance to show off the city of Oakland and all the great things that we've got here. But to me, it also is a chance to say that, in my opinion, and this is just one guy's opinion, but in my opinion, I wish they'd call them the Oakland Warriors. I mean, I'll be honest here, I've never really liked the name Golden State Warriors. We don't call them the Golden State A's. We don't call them the Golden State Raiders. That would sound ridiculous. And I know there are some who say, yeah, but the Warriors are a Bay Area team. Well, so are the Sharks. We don't call them the Golden State Sharks. They're the San Jose Sharks. And, Steph Curry. and wouldn't it be nice if, at least for the few remaining years that the Warriors have here, because in all likelihood they're going to San Francisco, wouldn't it be nice if they changed the name to the Oakland Warriors? Because my gut tells me as soon as they do move to the city, they're going to change the name to the San Francisco Warriors. Now, I'll be the first to admit, I am 100% biased when it comes to Oakland. This is my house in Oakland. I've lived here for more than 15 years. I love Oakland. And I get that we'll always be second to San Francisco. I mean, there's only one San Francisco. I get that. But when you think about it, there's still so many things that Oakland has to offer. City Center, Piedmont Avenue, First Friday, Jack London Square, Lake Merritt, International Boulevard, and I could keep going on. And yet, with all of that, I still get people who come up to me and they say, I would never go into Oakland. And I always want to say to them, what's wrong with you? Or they'll come up to me and they'll say, aren't you scared to live in Oakland? And I always say, of course not. Now I'll be the first to admit, Oakland has its issues. Um, I've gone to a number of funerals over the past couple of years on my own time for young black men and women who were gunned down. And while I was there, I talked to some of the folks and they were telling me that they've gone to so many funerals that now they only go if they really knew the person. I mean, think about that. And then there've also been all of the protests that have happened. Some of them have gotten completely out of hand and made national news. And the problem is that people see that and they think that the only thing that happens in Oakland are protests, violent clashes with police and killings. And then that perception becomes the reality. But the great thing here is that I truly believe that the perception of Oakland is starting to change. And part of the reason for that is the Warriors and the NBA Finals. More and more people are getting a chance to see that Oakland really is a city on the move. And whether you think of them as the Golden State Warriors, or in my case, as the Oakland Warriors, I think we can all agree on a couple of things. Let's take it to LeBron James, let's take it to Matthew Della Vadova, and let's beat the Cavaliers. Have a great week, stay strong, and go Warriors.